Rivers, out of 18 commissioners in Fubara's administration, 17 were appointed by Wiki, Jake Epele. Now to the news in full. Jake Epele, CEO of TAF Africa, <coughs> has spoken about the cause of the political conflict in River State between Governor Seminara Fubara and his predecessor, former Governor Yesom Wiki. In live coverage by Silverbed TV, Epele alleged that the conflict began when Fubara insisted, resisted Wiki's attempt to control the state's resources. According to Epele, this was the real cause of their disagreement, <coughs> rather than Wiki's claim that the conflict started due to Fubara's effort to undermine his Wiki's political structure. He also said Wiki appointed 17 out of the 18 commissioners in Fubara's cabinet. Can you imagine? Are you, are you the one that wants to work there? That you are the one that appointed 17 out of 18 commissioners for somebody? In Nepal's world, they wanted to be in absolute control of the resources of the state. And in such a manner that it will crumble the state and Fubara resisted them and refused to cave in. That started his problem. The mayor excuse that he wants to destroy our political structure has nothing to do with the issue. It is about resource control and asserting their political influence. It was more of wanting to appoint everybody that will work with Fubara out of 18 commissioners in Fubara's administration. 17 were appointed by Wiki. This is a known fact. Can you imagine? For somebody's cabinet, which is not your own, you want to control this person, you want to do everything in River State just because you helped him. Why? Just because she helped somebody, you want to you want to frustrate his efforts. Put your own people in his cabinet so that they will monitor him. So that they will come and tell you everything that he is doing wrong or anything that he's not doing your own way. It is well low. Kelly's Owen says, go and say it in the courts because this year noise is too late. You guys felt you can eat where you didn't sow. But God will expose you all in Jesus' name. Betrayal has no place in heaven. So it says, Didi, God punish you. Who appointed the governor? That useless man you now call governor. Go ask him again. Did he buy the form he contested as a governor? That one is not an issue. Okay, everybody knows that Fubara and Wiki helped Fubara to become governor. That is a known fact. Then we know that. But because you now helped him, you now want to start controlling everything in the state. You should do everything according to your will. You should do everything according to the way you say it. No, now. Things are not done that way. So because he refused to, now started giving him problems. Stephen Gabriel says, Wiki, boys, court and citizens of River State, who do you think has edge over one another? Evil men stand on evil activities. Even though Wiki is your bread provider, through his wickedness, one day it will come to an end. <coughs> Matthew Olorimari says, A pair stop hitting the politics instead of you people find amicable solutions to the crisis. You are taking sides just because of what you will both eat. Will eat both Wiki and Fubara are one. Were you there when things were good between them? Stop deceiving people. Where people have tried to resolve their issues, but Wiki is not agreeing. So what do you want people to do again? He's not accepting the fact that, okay, this person has is, is um, no longer the boy that you think he is. This person now has a mind of his own. You can't just control him. You can't just tell him what to do. And so he has, he has told you that because of that, you want to start frustrating him. You want to destroy your so-called structure just because somebody is not doing what you want. Matthew Lorimer says, a pair of stop hitting the politics instead of you people to find amicable solution. What amicable solution? I don't know. Choma Yamele says, he is evil and greedy. 
What he is doing with negative influence and excessive looting of public funds, thereby making masses to live below poverty level. People are starving, living below human standard, cause blood sucking politicians with illiterate and evil policies have destroyed democracy and economy. Tell you. Dr. K says they wanted to remote control the governor and keep on with channeling the state's resources to his pocket. God pass you. That is exactly what he wanted to do. He want to control this person. He will turn to a mumu, not having a mind of his own. Everything you say he should do. Everything you tell him to do, he should do it. You put 17 out of 18 uh, uh, appointees, 17 are your own. Why? Why? Ah. Now this person has said no, you say you, you, you want to fight him. Wisdom Ben says he's a greedy man indeed, very greedy. Kenneth Efigo says, Mr. Wickway should bear in mind that once you give a gold to someone, you have to also release the rope for him. Exactly. You've helped him. You've helped him. He has become the governor. Let him do his job. As the governor, don't try to control him. If you help somebody, leave your um, reward in the hands of God. You want to take reward by yourself. You want to collect everything by yourself. No. Tony Wilson says, wicked style of politics is totally different from what we were taught in school. If what Mr. Appel said is true, his politics is family affair, private business, hereditary, or could be operated via proxy. The insatiable taste for power and money is what we can call structure. I hope it doesn't succeed before he sets a bad precedent in Viva State. Yes, so, because you cannot continue to say that this is how you want something and things must always go your way just because you are wicked. No. Fubara was also appointed by wicked. It is a collective effort. So they should all enjoy the fruit of their labors. At least you didn't say Wiki appointed his wife and children. Whatever it is, you helped him, you evicted him, people voted for him. People also voted for him, so it cannot just be you. Everything cannot just go your way. Okay, you, you, you helped him, and now he's going against you. We just accept that you've made a mistake. Learn from your mistake. Don't do that mistake next time. But let it go. Don't try to frustrate this person's handbook. Don't try to say that, oh, I'm going to make sure you don't run that governorship seat very well. Because that is what you are doing, frustrating the guy. You don't want him to do anything again. Today, court case. Tomorrow, court case. Next tomorrow, court case. Please, just accept your L in peace and know that, okay, you have made a mistake with this one. Next time, you will not do that mistake again, Abby. My listeners, over to you. Leave your thoughts in the comment section. Do not forget to like, to share, and subscribe. Thank you. For